Today, you're gonna learn how to take audio just like this, which was recorded on a shotgun microphone, and turn it into crisp, clean, studio-sounding audio like this. This is a very, very simple effect. You can literally do it with the click of one button. It's a new effect in Adobe Premiere Pro. So without further ado, let's begin. Cineguac. So I used to always use the denoise effect to remove unwanted background noise, but it would always mute the sound of my dialogue. Recently, Adobe Premiere Pro came out with this new AI sound tool in the Essential Sound Workspace. Here's how you apply it. As you can see, I have this sound clip on my timeline, which I'd like to clean up. This is the audio that I will be enhancing. My voice is a bit echoey, and there's the subtle sound of a fan going on in the background, which I want to remove. Let's head over to Workspaces and select Essentials. Make sure your audio clip is selected, and go to the Essential Sound tab. All you have to do is click on this Enhance button. Using AI Magic, Premiere will automatically scan your clip to remove background noise and enhance the sound of your dialogue so that it sounds more like a studio recording. Depending on the length of your clip and the speed of your computer, this should take a few seconds or a few minutes. Once it's done, we can play that back. This is the audio that I will be enhancing. And you'll see it already sounds so much better. You can toggle the mix amount here, which will remove background noise even more. But if you crank it too high, sometimes it'll make your voice sound a bit pitchy or distorted. We can play that back. This is the audio that I will be enhancing. It still sounds pretty good, but it really depends on the quality of your sound recording. This Enhance tool works best when you already have a high-quality recording with a professional microphone. Now let's see what happens if we use audio that was filmed outside on our iPhone. So let's go to Essential Sound and enhance the sound of this iPhone clip. Play that back. Now let's see what happens if we use audio that was filmed outside on our iPhone. Definitely an improvement, although of course if there's a lot of wind, you're going to have trouble removing that entirely no matter what. And if we boost the mix amount... Now let's see what happens if we use audio that was filmed outside on our iPhone. Also sounds pretty good, although you can really begin to hear the distortion in my voice. Here you can also adjust the volume. Typically with dialogue, you want to live somewhere around the minus 12 to minus 9 dB. This is the audio that I will be enhancing. If you drop down this preset option here, you'll also have different effects that you can instantly apply to your clip. So let's select this outside a building effect. This is the audio that I will be enhancing. What do you know? Sounds like we're outside a building. And let's try this radio effect. This is the audio that I will be enhancing. And now it sounds like we're coming from a radio. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you learned a thing or two. As always, these videos take a really long time to put together. So show me some love. Hit that subscribe button and I will see you next time.